Hey guys, it's Haley Sunny. What the hell? I just went. Am I subconsciously like trying to be a rock star? I don't know. I'm back with another fitness video. I haven't done one of these in a while. Throwback to like when I first started getting into my like fitness journey. Literally for a few months, my channel was basically a fitness channel. This video is gonna be super fun. It's something that I've been a little lazy about. Like I've had this idea for a while. I just keep putting it off. So now I'm like kind of forcing myself to do it because I know that I'm gonna be so happy at the end of it. So what we're doing is eating healthy every single day and working out every single day for a whole week. After this, I'm gonna insert like a clip of like my body before and then I'll do one after just so we can see like the physical transformation. Obviously, I'm not expecting a lot because it's only a week. I just wanna kind of test out for myself how I would feel like mentally, physically, and look uh, physically if I were to like follow a very strict schedule. I like to live a healthy lifestyle, but I also like to keep a balance. Like if I wanna eat a cupcake, I'm not gonna restrict myself. I think having a cupcake and a pizza is like fine. We're only human. We're not gonna live forever. You might as well have some cheese pizza. You know, it's so good. But just for the sake of this video, I'm gonna refrain from like sugary foods, like desserts. I don't have like soda anyway. Pizzas, like pastas with like heavy cream sauce. Like I'm gonna try to eat very healthy and clean. I'll show you what I eat throughout the week as well. Also, just for reference, I am a pescatarian, so I don't eat chicken or red meat, and I've been like that for like four years. Let's get this week started. Like I'm... I'm so excited right now, but probably like midweek, I'll be like, why did I want to film this video this week? I'm just gonna push myself and I'm gonna do it. And if I do end up cheating, which I really am gonna try not to, I will like document it so you guys at least know and I'm just like not going behind your back. Also water, I start pretty much every morning with a bottle of water and I'm trying not to use plastic bottles. I just happen to have this one. That's also something I'm working on. Maybe I should do a video like being eco-friendly for a week. Let me know if you would watch that. But yeah, lots of water in the morning. So this is me before I woke up like an hour or so ago and I haven't eaten anything yet. Like I said, I'm not really doing this for like physical body reasons because obviously I don't expect results in like a week. I know it takes a lot more, but it's not like I'm just starting to work out like I've been working out. So I just want to see what would happen to my body if I kept it like consistent where I went to the gym every single day and was eating well. But yeah, this is me right now. I feel so weird like. This is me from the front. I'm like not sucking in or anything, not flexing my butt. That's me from the side, me from the back. I put on these shorts so you could also see like my lower abdominals. I had ramen at 12 a.m. last night, so that's really not helping my case right now. If I flexed, I feel like I could make my stomach look a little better. Okay, I can fix that. In a week, I'm gonna put on the same clothes and then I'll do this like again so we can compare. But yeah, this was basically me before. So I guess this is like the first food thing of this whole video. And it's also the first thing going in my system today besides water. This is a smoothie from Sun Life Organics. My mom just bought it for me. And I asked her to take a picture of the menu so I could tell you what's in it in case you like, I don't know, wanna make it at home or something. It's the smoothie I get every time I go there and it tastes amazing. So it's called the Wolverine and it has bananas, raw almond butter, medjool dates, maca, bee pollen, raw cacao nibs, and raw cacao nibs are the best thing that's ever happened to this planet. They basically taste like chocolate chips, but they're like a lot healthier. Raw coconut butter, royal jelly, and almond milk. I'm sure you could like basically do the same thing without using all those weird ass ingredients like royal jelly. I don't know what that means. It's yummy. It's healthy. They don't do straws. They do it like the Starbucks cup, so it's less plastic. And then they have like little pieces of dates and cacao nibs inside and you get to crunch on them because they're not fully blended. 10 out of 10 drink. It's kind of high in calories because it has like peanut butter, bananas. So I can have one of these and not get hungry for like a long amount of time and still have energy. Cheers. I was trying to make a tripod out of the spice rack and I spilled the cinnamon everywhere. So as you can see, I'm great in the kitchen. No worries because HelloFresh, can't believe I did that. HelloFresh has got my back. They're back on my channel. Oh, and my nails match 
this month's bag. As you know, I've worked with them a ton of times before this and they're sponsoring this video as well because I need help when it comes to the kitchen and they know how to help me. For those of you that don't know what HelloFresh is, it's basically a meal delivery service and they'll pre-plan, pre-measure a bunch of ingredients to make really yummy and healthy meals and they'll send them to you in like little baggies like this. So they'll deliver them right to your doorstep and now one meal serving with HelloFresh is literally $6.99 and they're recipes are so simple it takes less than 30 minutes to put together something they deliver all their ingredients super fresh and they're already measured for you so all you have to do is they'll send you like a card like this this is what we're gonna be making for lunch today it's a gorgeous greens farrow bowl and obviously looks really delicious and very yummy and on the back of it it'll have six steps that you need to follow in order to finalize your dish which they had me at six steps as you guys know, I'm a pescatarian and you can choose different meal plans that cater to your personal needs. So I like to go with the veggie plan. If you're a big family, you can go with that one. I like preparing my own meals because you know what goes inside that dish so you can make sure that it's really healthy. When you eat out, obviously you don't get that option because you don't watch your meal get prepared. I just feel more at peace when I know what I'm putting in my body. A little kickstart to your health journey. Just go on HelloFresh.com and enter my promo code, which is HaleyS80 and get $80 off. Off your first month so that's eight free meals and I'll also leave a link down below it's lunchtime okay <laughs> I didn't have like a recipe. It's cool that it makes you try new foods that you never would have before. Looking hello fresh. <laughs> So I'm about to head over to the gym. It's currently like 6.30. I think it's been like four hours since I last talked to you guys. I literally haven't eaten anything because I've just been so busy editing. Like I kind of forgot to. I wasn't really that hungry. Jax just farted. <laughs> Bro, you need to relax. But I'm kind of hungry now and I don't want to go to the gym hungry. So I'm going to grab something like light, maybe like a juice or something. After the gym, I want to have a really good like filling dinner. I'll try to film inside the gym. It'll probably be on my phone. Let's Let's go! I just wrapped up my workout. Now I'm at, you want to be in this or something? Like, are you trying to be famous? So yeah, we just finished your workout. I'm taking over this vlog actually. Also, <laughs> it says 96, relax. Oh yeah? I'm at this Mexican restaurant called Tokaya Organica. And it's basically like healthy Mexican food. So that's what I'm gonna have for dinner. I got a bowl. I'll show you what I got once it gets here. And I'm hungry. So this is what the bowl looks like. It comes with quinoa, beans, corn, avocado, and then this is halibut. So that's my protein. Everything in this is super healthy. And I'm gonna eat it now. <laughs> Hey guys, I just woke up. I feel a little sore from my workout yesterday. I went kind of hard. I don't really show you guys the workouts because I have like 
a ton of workout routines on my channel and I basically like did what I do in those I like do those in variations so I'll link my workout playlist down below I have so many workout videos that you can watch and follow through check those out they're hardcore they'll make you sore for the rest of the week I'm confident in them I feel good right now I think I had a pretty good day yesterday it was a good way to start it off I might go do some yoga today I don't know we'll figure it out but right now I'm gonna have breakfast I'm gonna bring you guys with me to the kitchen okay so we've chopped up some red bell peppers we're gonna put a little bit of olive oil on the pan pan is gonna be on medium I'm literally giving you my favorite egg recipe of all time I have two eggs in the morning A little bit of salt, let it sizzle on low. I don't usually have regular milk, but just for my eggs. Just a tiny little tiny baby bit of milk. And then just whisk it up. And then I add a little bit of cheddar cheese into this mixture. And then also a little bit of feta cheese. I like to scramble it personally. I feel like everyone knows how to make eggs. No one, Haley, makes eggs. If you don't incorporate Cholula somehow into your breakfast, I don't care if you're having cereal, you're just doing it wrong. Mm. This is the Middle Eastern in me. Hot. Left the house. I got a car wash. I'm about to go to the gym, but I want to eat beforehand. So I'm at Earth right now. I'm waiting on a salad. She says she loves me, but she don't. If y'all ever go to Earth, do yourself a favor and get the fruit and nut bread. Like, bread is already my favorite thing, but it also tastes like dessert. Told her, it's hard to say it, but it's true. I define the words that I'm supposed to say to you. It's time to pack your bags. I just left the gym and my arms are so sore from that workout that I don't think I can drive right now. Like, genuinely. Like, I'm not exaggerating. I'm gonna take like five minutes to like relax i did one of those high intensity interval training classes so it was basically like really intense cardio with a bunch of different exercises and you go around the room and there was a bunch of stations it was a class so like obviously i can't film but just know that i died i was like i think i'm gonna do yoga today and then i ended up doing that the class is literally called whipped like i'm whipped right now tomorrow i'm definitely just doing yoga because i honestly don't think my body can do anything else but yoga yoga's pretty hard too though not gonna lie but i just need to stretch out my muscles and then i'll be all ready again for thursday i don't know if this was very necessary since i'm literally just having this right oh my god my big double chin you can see it i'm having some grapes if you all cared as a snack at the moment uh yeah <laughs> I love it when I have like friends that aren't YouTubers. I'll be FaceTiming them and I'll be like, oh my God, I have to vlog me eating a grape right now. And they're like, are you okay? I just love being an influencer. This is me influencing all of your fruit decisions with my <laughs> Hey guys, oh my God, what are these dark circles? Those are just a part of me. It's not even because like I went to bed that late. The thing is I actually fell asleep last night. I was kind of waiting after my workout to get a little bit hungry so I could have like a good dinner. I wanted to have fish like my mom made fish and I fell asleep before I could even have my dinner. So I don't want you guys to think I'm like under eating or anything. Yesterday in general, I didn't eat that much. I'm not trying to like limit my calories or anything. I genuinely just fell asleep. Uh, but one thing that I did eat that I didn't show was like the second slice of bread that came with my salad yesterday, the fruit and nut bread because it just tastes so damn good and it's whole wheat bread with just like dried fruit and nuts in it like it's not bad for you and also it's good to fuel up with carbs especially when you're working out a lot my workout yesterday evening went really hardcore i'm so sore right now i can barely hold my vlog camera up like my arms are dying what i'm about to do now is bike over to a smoothie shop near me i'm going to creation i'm gonna grab a smoothie for breakfast and i also thought like maybe biking would 
stretch out my muscles. Also be like a quick little morning workout. I miss biking. Like in Santa Barbara, all I would ever do is bike. You guys probably know I never shut up about it. And like now my bike's just sitting in my front yard and like isn't really put to any use because like who bikes in LA, you know? But I'm about to bike for the first time. So I'm kind of excited. This is my bike. She's a good one. She's great. Okay, this is embarrassing because I haven't been on this thing in a minute now. I biked. I still have it in me. I can still do no hands. Quite proud of myself right now. I just ordered an acai bowl. That's gonna be my breakfast. I switched it up. I didn't want a smoothie anymore. The bike ride had me sweating though. I like how Creation has little testers. I'm testing out this almond milk like protein thing. And then this is a celery shot that's supposed to be a fat burner. Just chilling. What's up, girl? Ooh, she looks so fine. <laughs> Cucumbers, it's all right. She's almond butter, almond milk, and okay. This is the celery burner shot. Okay, that one just tastes like ass. This is what my bowl looks like. I got an acai bowl with granola and bananas and dried fruit. And it's my favorite thing to get here at Creation. It's called Acai Miracle. And usually it's a smoothie, but I asked them to put it in a bowl because they give it to you with all these toppings. And it's delicious. Lots of fruit to get you energized throughout the day. It's a beautiful day to ride a bike. I'm having lunch a little bit earlier today just because I felt a little hungry. I'm just having some plain pasta with a little bit of olive oil, garlic, and then shrimps for protein and some black pepper also. As a side, I'm just having some steamed broccoli with olive oil and then lemon juice. Good and fresh. I'm literally having this in bed as I'm editing a video. I literally have to go down these stairs and I just physically cannot. Like my legs hurt so bad, like my quads from both my workouts from the past two days. It's painful to try to go down these stairs. Also currently drinking some vitamin C water because after getting strep three times within the span of two months, I have decided that I'm not getting sick anymore. So I try to keep my immune system strong by like taking vitamin C and stuff. Today, we're going back to the gym. No days off. It's Wednesday. I think I'm going pretty strong. It's like the third day and I haven't cheated at all. I don't think I have the physical ability to like go do a hard workout today. So I'm just gonna be doing a yoga class, an hour and a half of a class, which is also very long, but I just needed to stretch out my muscles and you know, make sure they recover safely before I go back tomorrow and do another hard workout. So that's what I'm doing. And it's gonna be a pretty late class. It's gonna be a 7.15 class and it's vinyasa yoga which means it's the most relaxing type of yoga there is and i'm gonna feel like going to bed straight after so i'm super super excited i just can't wait